Well, game day back at the Scotiabank Saddle. Don't finish off that five-game, uh, 10-day road trip. Right, Coleman stops in, and uh, maybe let's just start. Uh, well, welcome back to Calgary. Eh? We get a little snowfall coming in, and it kind of feels like uh, it's a different type of hockey season when we uh, land back in Calgary this week. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, winter's here. That's what we keep saying <laughs> in our house. Um, it's good to be home, though. It's, yeah. uh, it was a long trip, obviously, to start the year. Um, so hopefully we can turn the page on that one quick here. And yeah. Get, uh, get some better play here at home. Well, we know it's a big week uh, in terms of, you know, all set up here in Alberta, but maybe just first uh, this one here, uh, Tuesday night. And, and obviously, as you said, to, you know, get back on home ice and maybe reestablish your game here. Yeah, it's important. I think, you know, we had some actual, actually some pretty good performances uh, early in the trip and yeah. just didn't find ways to get uh, two points out of all those games. And and too many letdowns, and then obviously uh, a disappointing way to end the trip. So for us, it's it's turn the page, um, get the mentality back. Um, you know, home ice, I think, is, is going to be important for us this year, and we've got to find a way to make that uh, an advantage. And, um, you know, we know our crowd's going to be there and be loud, and it's uh, it's always fun to play at the Dome. Well, we know it's easy, you know, always to look back at the last one and maybe you had that feeling about the last one, but when you look at the totality of the road trip, and as you said, the start of it, and, and what you guys felt early on, can you go right back to that? Can you go back to that feeling of, hey, like we, it wasn't that far removed that we felt real good about our game? Yeah, I think for us, you got to look at that game as a write-off um, versus the other way around, I think. Yeah. Um, you know, look to our performances in, in Buffalo and, you know, I, obviously Washington um, get the shootout loss, but yeah. thought we dictated the game and, and played the right way that game. And so I think those are the games we need to kind of play and uh, find some more ways to, to finish finish off some chances but um, you know if we play like we did in Detroit uh, it's gonna be a long year so I think um, ultimately it's on us to to write that game off and, and be much better. Last one for you and that's just as a forward group do you feel like you're uh, seeing the chances the types of chances you want to be seeing right now or are there a little bit more uh, you know in terms of offense you can generate? Yeah there's definitely more we can generate I think you know it's it's been an emphasis for us that you know a lot of it you don't have to force it. I think you take care of your own end and, and that stuff starts to come. And I think, you know, way too many grade A chances um, over the last couple games and against, I should say. Yeah. And uh, I think when you're spending less time in your zone, just inherently you're going to get more offense and, and more chances at the net. So, um, you know, we need to be quicker on our own end, kill plays and, and spend more time wearing the other teams down. And that's when uh, goals start to fall. Well, welcome back home and uh, have fun. Have some fun tonight. Yeah. Thanks, Parks. Appreciate it. Cool.